correctly? Why do I need to do these things, these spiritual disciplines, to be a Christian? What's the purpose of that? Uh, can I just accept Christ? Can I just repent of my sins and call myself a Christian and everything be good? Well, here's the deal. No, you can't. Uh, because this this stuff matters, right? This life matters. This this belief matters. This conviction matters. This confession matters. And and as a Christian, if we find ourselves saying we're a Christian, but we're not doing any of the things that Jesus tells us to do, that Jesus models for us to do, then when the time comes and, and the waves hit in our life and our family gets sick, we get that terminal illness diagnosis, we lose our house, money's tight, you know, these things that, that are out of our control when life gets real, you know what I'm saying? When that happens, the real you, the person in you, the man in you, the woman in you is going to come out. And if you've not built anything, the essence and nature of who you are, if you're not disciplining yourself to focus on God, to be resilient and have resolve and trust Christ through those times, you're going to crumble and fall apart. But if you've spent time developing and cultivating a character that's founded on the word of God and Jesus Christ, you're going to go through that. You're going to go through that flame and that fire and you're going to come out on top. So, Beloved, let's, let's, let's find ourselves, right? Let's find ourselves being disciplined in what we do to develop the character of the type of person we want to be.